transforming. Transform. Yes, we're going to change it all up. Yes. So right now we're looking at polished. Yes. So polished is when you're thinking of a master bedroom, but these days say principal. That's what they call it now. Well, you should call it principal. It's not about the guys anymore. Come on. Like, like, oh, because master even it is like yes. a gender oh, thing. Seriously. So let's okay. Can principal we call it the bed. mistress room? <laughs> you can if you want. Come on. The principal. So it's the principal bedroom. That's fancy. When you're thinking about dressing a bed for that, usually it's about something that looks more polished, yes. has a little bit of shine, yeah. and has lots of texture to it as well. Okay. So these pieces, basically, this is the whole bed that you're seeing here is the hotel collection. It's beautiful. This is wood rose, which is a really pretty pattern. But the great thing about this is all of the work from a design perspective is actually done for you already. Right. So all of these different textures and even the, the stitching in the quilt is all part of the wood rose collection. So okay. it is completely idiot proof. Yes. You can dress a perfect bed with all of the right kind of patterns, textures and finishes to make it look good. It's like a paint by numbers. It really is. Just buy all the pieces in the set sure. and it's perfect. And you've got two, four, so you've got seven cushions here. There aren't enough. There could be more. <laughs> Come on. We need 14. We could do more, absolutely. But what you're seeing here is, is what I think is how a well-dressed bed should look. It's gorgeous. So these days, what you're looking at is, is a quilt tight over the, over the mattress, yeah. of, over top of a fitted sheet and flat sheet. Mm -hmm. And then the duvet itself is wrapped at the bottom of the bed, which gives you a very plush look. Yes. So that whole look really does look very, very inviting. And what I want to do with this, too, is it looks romantic, but it's in a more contemporary-looking bed frame. So I this agree. is the Ark bed, which is from my collection at Hudson's Bay. Aaron, you've done a lovely Thank you. job. Comes in a king size as well if you want to go nice. big. So it does yeah. look good though. Um, and I really like the idea of taking a canopy bed like this and making it look romantic, but still modern as well. That's right. You want that contemporary feeling still. Maybe you don't want it to be like a little bit too flowery. This is perfect. It this is, is perfect. Transitional. Everybody's happy. I feel like I want to dive in. Yes. So now. Talking of diving. Yes. The color on the wall. Dark salmon, Very nice. stunning. Yeah. Now there's a morning glow that will make you look spectacular. Right? That color on the wall, yeah, yeah, for Good sure. Good on everyone. Yes. So, shall we have a go at changing it out? So we're going polished right now, yeah. but we can do playful as well, so let's give it a go. Okay. All right. So playful, does that sort of, um, is this sort of like a guest space now? Well, is that what we're doing? Yes, or? you could look at it that way for okay. sure, but really what it's about is is you do you, really, when it okay. comes to design. Come on, right. you have to pick it. Whoops, throw, there we go. Good catch, good catch, good catch. Yeah. Do we we'll want leave, all of these gone? Uh, well, no, we're going to leave the white ones. Okay. Take that as well. All right. But what you're doing is you're creating a space that really speaks to you. Right. So that is what comes down to um, pattern, this texture, and finish. Off? That is coming right off. Okay. I'll keep it away from my makeup face. <laughs> yes, please do. Please don't return that. Now, I've got to ask you a question. Do you press your sheets? No. <laughs> no. Of course. Doesn't everyone? No. All right. Grab, grab that. Should I be pressing my sheets? Isn't that the, with the dryer? I have, I have friends that press their sheets. Oh I do boy. not. Who's got so time? this is actually my oh, preferred look, which is a little bit more relaxed. So just pull it down oh, at the bottom so nice. there. I'm going to get you to pull it across. You probably need a little bit more on your end. Sure. There we go. Is that better? Yes. So this is more contemporary. So this is the uh, boutique collection from Distinctly Home. Oh, it's gorgeous. Beautiful pattern on this. Yes. Really, really stunning. Let's flip it over so you okay. see the return on there. So that's, well, in these kind of beds, what you're looking for is something that looks a little bit more oh, fresh and nice. a little bit more fun. So the combination of patterns there, again, all that work has been done for you. Yeah. So you want to make sure you have, I mean, I like using the, does anyone use the really big pillows now? What are they called? Euros. The Euros. Yes. It's nice when you've got a frame like this because it gives you a little bar at the back to rest it against. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. So it makes it comfortable. Yeah. So we're going for a more relaxed look here, but you do need to have fun with the toss cushions too. Oh, yeah. This so is So step good. outside of the box a little bit. All right. And have some fun with some more playful ones. Now, let me ask you a controversial question. Yes. And I don't want to screw up all of this because it looks amazing. <laughs> You're but not screwing it up at all. Would you ever do the? Would you ever you do that? You can do layered as well. Layered actually do does guys, look. Do any of you do that? Okay, she's with me. So layered does like look that. more contemporary like this. So yeah. if you want a more contemporary look, that is a great way to do it as well. Yeah, but I like the way you artfully did like, and this one's just like that. Yes, just like, slightly <laughs> tossed on an angle there. Because it should it's look perfect. relaxed. It shouldn't look like concrete. It looks it has to look comfortable. This looks gorgeous. Thank you. And all from Hudson's Bay. 